Easy Company Gaming and Collectibles, which is now probably Easy Company Gaming, or Easy Company Collectibles and Gaming. And it's really late at night, and I just ate a pineapple. But here we are, I'm thinking about creating a new series um, called Pass or Buy, or Buy or Pass. Buy or Pass or Buy, I don't know, put it in the comments below. I'm going to do a thing about, um... So we buy or pass these figures because lately I've been seeing a lot of my content and the uh, viewers are subscribed for content like figures and reviews and stuff like that. I do my gaming like probably once a week, but I'm going to do a new one. Uh, it's going to be called buy or pass. And we're going to go over figures that I preferably me just go for like stuff like hot toys mainly star wars mainly all that kind of stuff anything i like i'll just go over and talk about it and blah 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 all day long about it um so what i'm gonna do is um basically i'm going to uh i knew it was coming um just go over stuff and just tell you my verdict on things tell you my verdict on if i should buy it or i should pass it and that thing, hopefully, leading you to buy this figure or pass this figure. I don't know what you prefer, buy or pass. But according to my information and my knowledge on the figure and how the figure is going to affect the future of the way things are. So hopefully I can get this, get this series kicked up. And make sure you like the video and subscribe if you want to see more of this. Comment down below what you think of it. But let's start off with our very first figure. Our very first figure is going to be the Hot Toys Luke Skywalker figure, which I have up right here. It's on pre-order. It's been out for a while. Of course, I'm going to go through some figures that's been out for a while because this is the start of the series. So, therefore, you'll see these older figures get it older because the dude's actually old anyway. But this Luke Skywalker figure, I've been debating about... Um, I've been um, debating about this guy because Luke Skywalker is one of... If you've seen the movie, this is going to be all spoiled. I don't care. Even it goes into episode 8. Um, Luke Skywalker is at the very end of the uh, movie. And Rey is handing him... Luke Skywalker I thought he was a myth. And she's handing him the lightsaber and he's like taking it. And not... <laughs> that sounded kind of gay. <laughs> but he, and, and then... Like, he has his robotic arm, and he doesn't really take the lightsaber from her. He just kind of like... It's like <laughs> so, I was like... I was wondering if um, Luke Skywalker is going to be in Episode Eight. Um, Will he fight Kylo Ren? And if he does fight Kylo Ren, he's going to come with a lightsaber. Um, it's just the, the figure right here, like, as you can see... The likeness to him. I would love to put him in this pose right now. I would love to just shape him into this pose right now. I was about to get him. I was about to get him. And maybe I will still get him. But my verdict goes till the end of this video. And his the likeness. Just the likeness around his... Oh, baby. Oh. The likeness around his face. The old, the old dudes that Hot Toys do. Like the old guys. Hot Toys is amazing at doing making old people look like amazing people. Like the Obi-Wan figure that is not not being sold anymore is an amazing figure. That's that's just hands down I love that figure. One of my favorite figures. Now this Luke Skywalker for The Force Awakens and then The Last Jedi basically Luke which in the Last Jedi trailer, he's wearing a shorter type of robe, like this robe off, and he's just having on his tunic. Um, here we can see more. He comes with these hands, so then with that tunic and all that stuff being shown in The Last Jedi, I'm afraid, like, there's rumors of him going to fight Kylo Ren and him training Rey and him meeting up with Princess Leia and all that kind of stuff. So um, this is all that he comes with. So the stuff that he comes with, I'm like, he has no lightsaber. He has this cool base. For $2.29, I think this is a really good steal. And you can use your $20 off codes on this guy. So that's going to be a addition. So basically free shipping from Sideshow if you're deciding from Sideshow. Free shipping with $20 off if you if you have purchased a figure and you can use it on this guy. So you get it for basically $2.30 right out the door. Or the shopping cart in your online store checkout. But... He comes with all this stuff, but I'm like, I want a lightsaber. I want all these things. I'm like, what if, like, 
Kylo Ren gives him a cool scar, just like, you know, Anakin has his scar, Kylo Ren, Darth Vader has his, well, his whole body's a scar in general, but, like, what if he gets one? That would be so cool, so I was, like, waiting, get him or not get him, so let's go over some more things that may persuade you or may dissuade you, I don't know if that's a word, but... He comes with one uh, right fist, a relaxed right hand, gesturing right hand, as well as left fist, left hand, and left same hands. But there, um, his his right hand is the uh, mechanical hand that he has, the mechanical right hands. Yeah, so he just has his thirty points of articulation, just like anywhere anyone else, and um, gray boots. The diorama base is really a um great addition you get to him because he does also come with the standard as you can see here he does come with the standard freaking uh kind of boring what i see is boring first force awakens uh base so that's 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 oh where'd he go where yeah that's him but that that guy is for 229 and my verdict on these fig on this figure if you absolutely loved the force awakens get him and if you think you're gonna love the last jedi and you have money get him because there will be another one released because to me i feel i'm not going to get him i don't have money sitting around that i can just pay this pretty price so i'm going to have to just hold off because if you can see like the uh what was it thor I think it was Thor from Avengers. Their face sculpts got better and better. Even Robert Downey Jr. and Iron Man, or Tony Stark from Avengers, their face sculpts got better and better. Um, so all those people got really, really good. Like Wonder Woman, they kind of did kind of off with them, and I was like, eh, Wonder Woman doesn't look like Wonder Woman. Her awesomeness is there, but then they released the training figure like the training woman and that really looks like gal gadot's wonder woman that really looks like her they're nailing that because hot toys have basically had a little problem or issue with women but this one i'm going to have to pass i say pass so this pass is going to be till the next luke skywalker or until he dies basically because Hot Toys will always milk the crap out of Star Wars, and they're going to make a Luke for each, every single movie they can, in each, every single costume they can, just like they did with Rey. I have the Rey, and she's amazing. I mean, I wouldn't buy it, but I was giving it to her for free, so hey. But this one, I'm going to have to pass. So for $2.29, it's, it's really good. I'm afraid by the next time we get the next Luke, it's going to be up to like $2.34, then creeping up to $2.39, because Hot Toys are going up and sideshow did email me and tell me straightforward iron prices are going up and i was like dude like seriously man like how could you do that to us like it's really not part of the community to like really really so that's my verdict is passed so hope you enjoyed this uh little um series i'm going to start the buy or pass and then hot toys or black series or sideshow or sh figure arts or bandai kits whatever it may be i'm going to do all kinds of figures because i love the figure talk i just love it um regard this you can just exit out from here because there's no more about the figure i'm basically going to ramble on and on and on about the uh what i'm doing here but i'm going to do that about figures and I'm going to, like, tell you in late night. This is really late night, so I'm just having my light on. I'm like, <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoyed, and stay tuned. Like the video if you liked it. Like, like, like. Subscribe. Comment down below what you want to see or review on. Buy or pass my verdict on. So this is Easy Company Gaming and Collectibles, possibly changing my title to Easy Company Collectibles and Gaming. Therefore, because I am just going crazy over figures. Okay, bye. I love you, too.